in my own sets and the sets I've spectated, whether start Smashville or Battlefield against Ness. They're going town. All right, not a bad choice. A lot of advantage here for both characters. Ness would be such a great character if Rosa wasn't a thing. You're not wrong. All right, only went for the double fair, but he got banana in exchange. Um, I feel like he should have maybe Edgar a little bit more. It is Diddy Kong. Yeah, PK um, Thunder PK, should be a very scary thing. PK Thunder is a very, kit. very scary, and PK Fire like angled downwards mm -hmm. to cover ledge. Perry showing off a lot of aggression here. All right, he's kind of prioritizing picking up the banana, uh, but Leo's not giving him enough space to use the banana in any meaningful way. And Ness is just a little bit too slow to compete with the speed at which that he can fly and across the stage. Rolls. That beautiful, beautiful roll. But we did see in uh, the first set on stream, I believe, he got, he got down tilt, the trip, immediately into F-Smash. Oh. He, he knew the trip was cut there. So there we go. A, P a PK Thunder. I want to see more of those if Diddy's offstage. Mm -hmm. It's an extremely useful tool in this matchup. Yeah, just throw it high, force him to recover low, and then turn that back around. Um, right now, more scared for for the Diddy Kong than I am for Ness. A, a back throw near any of the ledge is guaranteed Ooh. death. Oh, that was a questionable DI. Sus. Yeah, that was sus. That was sus. Sus speed. Oh, 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 okay. That was a really clutch banana toss by Leo. He's covering himself when he recovers. Okay, good offense right there. Trying to go for the double fair. That hitbox is ginormous, guys. Ooh, all right, good thunder, yes. Ooh, Ooh going for the grab. Yeah, any character that has a kill throw, if they roll behind you towards the ledge, just expect the grab. And if they're near the ledge, expect that they're going to spot dodge, then grab. Oh, yep. And not being able to find a grab, he's kind of uh, resorting to fast fall up here. Commentator's curse, boys and girls, it's real. Yep, and he was doing it before I could say that he was doing it. I'm only a little bit psychic, not enough. Ooh, almost. Trying oh. to get some nice extensions there. Buttons. Lots of buttons. So many buttons. <laughs> oh, goodness. They would be a great Bayonetta player. You know what? I feel like you say that a lot. <laughs> I just have a, a strange feeling. All you gotta do is press up B, and you too. Oh, okay, no guard. jump. Is it happening? Oh, mistimed it right there for a second. All right. That was some great option coverage, though, by Pears. And still living. He's got about one more chance. One more. Down oh. tilt, though. Uh, That's it. Oh, messing it up. Oh. Doesn't matter, though, because wow. it's frame four. Yeah. All right, so game one, going to PBG Leo. Rather decisively. Uh, Leo just really exploiting the fact that Ness is too slow to punish a lot of the Diddy shenanigans. So I'd like to see Paris pick kind of a smaller stage, maybe uh, Smashville, Smashville, or Battlefield. I'd like to see. Um, yeah, I'm gonna see Smashville probably. Or is he gonna go Luigi? <gasps> Little rock. What? 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 Hex. We're seeing the Rob. I've never seen Hex. Leo's can Rob. you go find your setup, please? Um, but hey, he has a game to play with, having won game one. So, um, I've never seen the Rob. I think except for like once. It wasn't that bad though. I wonder what Rob does in this matchup though, if they're not in the lead. Um, recovers easier than both of his two mains, I guess. Um. But I don't. I'm not. I don't understand what Rob does better than Diddy. Correct. So right there, we saw him down tilting towards the gyro, attempting to to get Ness to hit the gyro and b go back at him. It's a little frame trap. That's right nasty. There. It's a little frame trap that Rob. It's a little had. gross. Were you able to hear me call for hacks? Call for hacks. All right. It's not. Yeah. It's. It's not looking quite as clean as his Diddy Kong was. Uh, he shouldn't die from this, right? Yeah, okay, good. He has a match. Hex versus Babinski in the back. Hex versus Babinski in the back. Also in the back. Tommy versus 
This might just be a for fun thing, honestly. Maybe. Okay, this is going to lead to a kill. Get, no, didn't uh, didn't take the air dodge. I guess it was still out. a 50-50 at that point. Leo has a good Rob. It's kind of weird because I typically see Rob do a lot of landing nair. Um, but not Leo. Um, I feel... Uh, okay. okay, all right. Okay, all right, okay. Got him anyway. Good stuff, covering him to the platform. In those situ yes. situations, you just really need to fade back and guess. <laughs> oh my god. Good that, percent right there, 41. He got extra damage from the gyro hitting him while he was grabbed. So gross. Pair is not finding this kill here. Rob is a lot heavier. That would have probably killed Diddy Kong. Actually, no, it would have 100% killed Diddy Kong. All right, and I don't agree with Pairs letting it back for free. You can easily thunder. You can easily you, you know, can do drop a lot it. of options. Mm -hmm. Is Pairs shook though? It looks to be. Looking a little shook. <laughs> and the first landing there, he does. He gets grabbed for it. 96% though, puts, uh -huh. I, I believe that puts him back into Beepu percent. Yeah, he grabbed him before, uh, maybe not now, but... Okay, this is damage, Pears needs this. Okay, there we go, he finally tried to go for that aerial PK fire. Alright, but Leo laying it on, not giving a moment to rest. Leo. Oh no. It's like Leo, like Leo Heart, guys. Oh! He might have died from that, from the reverse hit of PK yes. Thunder 2. Like, it is strong. Um, not finding the kill right now though, 124 on Nest, random up smash. Um, uh, um, uh, um, we're not dead, yeah, okay. Almost dead from that. Knockback growth. I wanted to do something, do something. Yes, he's dead. Out of gas. Oh, goodness. All right. That up air cost him. It did. He could have grabbed the ledge and tried to make it back to center stage. Yeah, quite literally, the gas is a resource. And you can spend it a couple ways. You can go high. You can do a rising aerial to hit people. Um, or you can just save it and recover. Uh, just a little bit of mismanagement. And pairs finally going off stage and bullying him. We're probably going to see... Honestly, I... FD. You shouldn't take Nest to Smashville willingly, usually. Wouldn't pairs ban FD? Lilat? I think Lilat would be a better stage for Nest than... Oh, we're going back to town. Okay. Interesting. Wait. Is he allowed to? Didn't Le Leo I, won on town? I guess if pairs allowed it. Okay. It's on each individual player to be aware of the rule set, so... Should have been three stock tonight. <laughs> Should have been, uh, what is it, one stock, best of seven? Okay, honestly, though, that sounds great. Honestly. All right, Ness hitting him with the kicks and the beeps, the bops. Ah, hotness. Oh, okay, that was looking pretty hot for a second. That there. really was. It almost led to a, a nice head guard situation there. Yeah, I okay. think Pears is really feeling it right now. Pairs not allowing. Uh, okay, good. Uh, oh, that's plot armor, guys. That is what we consider plot armor. Diddy privilege. It's real. Oh God. When you get stage spiked out of barrels and you travel up and around the stage and land safely. All right, back throw gonna take it. Yes. No privilege will save you from back throw though. All right, last stock for this set for PBG Leo. This is the best pairs has looked all set. Amazing. Um, yeah. Radiant, I'd even say. <laughs> Glamorous. Okay, good stuff by Leo. Yes. Okay. Not gonna take it. Ooh. Leo looking surprised. Even do doing a little not bad. Alright, doesn't go. matter though. Banana. Yeah, Leo did a really great job following his jump. Just Bring it all the way back. Leo saying, I'm not out of this yet. But one more explosive nest combo, and Leo could find himself in trouble. Ooh. Okay, no reversal. Getting Ness off stage. I feel like getting Ness off stage is key to do in most matchups just because 9 out of 10 times, 
how Ness recovers is they will uh, they'll double jump air dodge through you to recover. Mm -hmm. They'd really rather avoid using PK Thunder. Well, Leo really hasn't been exploiting that too much. He, we could see it here. Nope. No, just guys. If you believe in your tech skill, and I have to, <laughs> yeah. I have to put a warning label here. Attempt this at your own risk. If you are at a decent, if you're, if if you want to gimp Ness out of PK Thunder. Ooh. Oh, is that it? Okay, it. good DI yeah, two. Luckily for Ness, would uh, Peanut? No, steal? Peanut breaks on everything. Okay. Which I thought it beat Gordo. Well, Gordo also loses to stuff. Loses to everything. Ooh, he's dead! Catching the monkey flip. I, th I feel like this is a recurring theme nowadays with Diddy Kongs of people just catching their monkey flips and then...